think you'll notice it on, on almost on all the par fives. This is a hole 14, 590. They're almost all um, like double dog legs. Wind is kind of there, somewhere there. You know, they want you to play the hole into here, then lay up down into here, and then play a wedge into the green. But every tour player, me included, back in the day, were trying to figure out a way to get over here somewhere, maybe a little left of that, just there. So now we might have a try to hit it over everything. And you see it, it's just, they've got plenty of distance. It's just, you get, there's trees everywhere and you've got, barely got any gaps to do it. And of course the wind's this way. So you finish up hitting your drive and you go over here. So it's all about this tee shot. It's just so narrow in there and just so hard to get it exactly where you want it. You know, you can always chip it down the fairway and then play in from there. But, you know, it's this this water, you cannot see the water when you're up here. It's a blind shot. The whole shot from here is blind to the green. You might be able to see the top of the pin. But I think this is the third kind of double dog leg par five we've seen on this course already.